guys, so today I wanted to do my first haul video, which is very exciting because I love to watch haul videos. Um, I didn't do all of the shopping today, it's been kind of over the past two weeks, but um, I wanted to show you what I picked up. First off, I'm most excited about this, and I got some stuff from the new Mac collection, the Archie's Girls collection. Um, I only got two things, I had to like stop myself because I told myself I wasn't going to buy any makeup this month, but too cute packaging. Um, this one is the lipstick in Girl Next Door and it's just this really pretty bubblegum pink color. It's so cute. It's super super pretty. It's this really cute bubblegum color. Um, I don't wear lipstick that often but the packaging is so cute and the color is so cute I could not pass it up. So there's that. And also from that collection I got um, the blush in cream soda and both the things I got were on Betty's side of the collection and it is this really pretty peachy shimmery color um you see that yeah Ooh, I like that a lot I'm really really excited about this and look at the packaging it's so cute sorry about the glare but yeah so I picked up those two things from Mac I also went to Ulta recently and I picked up this mint candy apple Essie color which I have on my nails right now um, it's super duper pretty. I saw somebody wearing this the other day and I was like, is that OPI? And they're like, no, it's Essie. And I had to have it, so I just went and got it. So it's this really pretty. It almost looks more blue than mint green, but I ain't hating on it. I still like it. So yeah. Also from Ulta, I got the new Naked Urban Decay Flushed Palette, which is their blush situation. And it's um, just this really pretty blush palette. It's got the blush, the highlighter, and the bronzer. So um... Yeah, I'm still playing with this. I'm not 100% sure how I feel about it, but I love the Urban Decay Naked stuff, so I had to add this to my Naked collection. Also today I went to Bath & Body Works because they're having their 2 for 20 candle sale situation and I cannot pass that up. Um, I'm still really loving my wintry candles, but I went and I sniffed some and I was like, oh, well, I have to have these. This one was my favorite. It's called the Garden Fiesta and it's this really pretty purple color, which is my favorite. And it smells so good. Oh, go Oh, I thought it was Garden Fiesta. It's Garden Freesia. No wonder I like it. The scent of freshly cut freesia blends flawlessly with violet petals and a touch of sandalwood. Garden Fiesta. I am losing my mind. But yeah, that one. And then I also got a favorite, and it is Frosted Cupcake. Um, hmm. A true food lover's delight. Fresh vanilla bean, sugar, cake batter, and rich buttercream frosting mix it up and create an irresistible scent, which is true. If you haven't tried these candles, they're my favorite because they're three wick, which means they burn kind of faster than other candles, but they burn evenly, which I really, really like. I hate when I have a candle that's just like only burning the center, and I'm like, hello? That's so much you're wasting. So I really like these, and like the scent payoff is really, really great. And then at Bath & Body Works, I had a coupon for a free signature item. So I got the um, Moonlight Path version of the Triple Moisture Cream body cream, like I said I was going to. I really like this um, formula, so I wanted to get it in my favorite scent, which is Moonlight Path. And then the last thing I wanted to show you, I went to the Wild Fox sample sale, I think it was two weeks ago today, actually. And I just wanted to show you what I got, because I'm obsessed. I freaked out when I saw this, and it is, I don't know, it's the Baggy Beach Jumper. They're super soft. I'm obsessed with Wild Fox, by the way. If you follow me on Instagram, you know that. But it's the Wild Beach Jumper with these two creepy Cupid Angel Baby things on it, and I really wanted this, so I was really stoked to see it. So, pretty stoked about that. And it was more than half off the original price, so cha-ching. This shirt... I wasn't intending on getting, like, I wasn't going there to find it, but I'm so glad I did because I've already worn it, like, three times. And it's this, like, neon yellow shirt situation with this ram skull, and there's, like, feathers and a cross, and it's just super cool. And I really like the fit of this. And this was $20! I was so stoked. So, there's that. Oh, the lighting is going crazy. This I was super stoked about because on Cyber Monday I had this in my cart on wildfox.com and then I waited to, I waited all day because I was lazy and didn't want to get up and get my wallet and then when I finally did, then when I finally went to order it, it was sold out so I was super bummed. But, found it at the sample sale y'all. It's this, I don't want the lighting to go all weird but, 
It's this t-shirt with bows all over it, front and back. It's so, so cute. And this was originally $80 and I got it for $30, so pretty stoked. And then after all the sample sale excitement, I always like to check eBay because I feel like people go to the sample sale and then they get too much and they're like, oh, I don't really need this, I can sell it on eBay. But I don't even know if that's what happens, it's just what my mind thinks. And I've been wanting this one for a while and I got it for also more than half off and it is the Lipstick Baggy Beach Jumper. A bunch of people have this, but I can never find it and I really, really like it and it's so soft and it's a good color for me and I'm just really stoked about it. So I got that. And that is the end of my haul. Um, I'm very excited about all my new stuff, especially the Wild Fox. Well, everything, let's be real. Um, so yeah, if you liked this, give it a thumbs up. Um, coming up next is something to do with my hair, so get excited, uh, I guess. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.